Including Stylet Oil in your crop management rotation is an environmentally safe and effective way to protect your grapes against mite infestation. So be sure to visit www.styletoil.com today. Hello, I'm Matthew Malcolm with Pacific Nut Producer Magazine and here today at the annual Statewide Pistachio Day in Visalia, Farm Advisor Craig Carlson discussed new varieties and pollinizers for pistachios coming into development at the UC. Uh, the need for replacement for uh, uh, Kerman has kind of recently shown up based on some of our low chill years where Peters is, uh, seems to have a problem with low chill compared to uh, perhaps even Kerman. We don't get a good match when we have low chill years between the two. You know, the, the pro probably some of our more successful and really one of the very few varieties that have been released since uh, Kerman was the Golden Hills and Lost Hills duo. And uh, they're widely gaining acceptance in the industry. You know, it was a slow start, and uh, but as the acreage has increased, people realize we need some varieties that mature. Um, at a different time than Kermit. Otherwise, you know, you need all the shakers and all the people and all the processors need to be working at a relatively short Kermit harvest. So that was one of the impetus for uh, developing the Golden Hills and Lost Hills varieties. And they make up about, probably about 10% of the planted acreage now. Of course, a lot of them are still non bearing, but uh, the acceptance has been good. And I think word of mouth is spreading that uh, they have a useful part to play in the industry. So now recently, and of course we released those about 2004, 2005. Now here we are all the way to 2015 with not a whole lot coming in in between. But we're, we finally got sort of an interesting variety. Uh, uh, it's still not released to the public, but I think we're making progress toward that point. It's an even earlier maturing variety. It may mature as early as early August in some areas. And it's... Uh, Seems to have a nut quality characteristic, somewhat similar to Golden Hills, so it's got a good split percentage. Um, and uh, of course, we, if you have an earlier maturing variety, it usually is earlier blooming, which this is. And we, of course, we have to have a male associated with that. We've, we've got a male that's going to work, and perhaps some other ones we may add later. Uh, so it's a pretty exciting time for the for, for us in the industry. We've also tried to find a. a, a placement or at least an adjunct pollinizer for Peters, you know, the one that goes with Kerman, because Peters has had some problems in the low chill years. So making progress on, on that on that uh, uh, front as well. So in general, I, I think the pistachio industry may have some, some even newer varieties to look at in the not so distant future. Thank you, Craig. Stay current on the latest nut varieties becoming available to the industry by reading Pacific Nut Producer Magazine. I'm Matthew Malcolm, CaliforniaAgNet.com.